Couple of trainers here going for doubles. Paul Fagan, Graham Smith, Lisa Rasmussen. So they move up well. Last of the runners getting set. Track about to be cleared. Lights on. And the lure starting. Here they go. Murray Bridge. They're off. And Aston Ability was third away. One of the first to begin there was Corborn Crosses showing good speed of Linga Lily. Now going up very quickly on the outside is the favourite Aston Ability and it's going to draw to the front. Aston Ability shows out around the outside. Woodside Puma putting himself into it. Getting along the inside of Linga Mal. Down the straight though. No worries about Aston Ability. Beats a Linga Mal. Woodside Puma. They're followed by Corborn Cross. Running on there was Mayo Fernando was doing its best work. And they're followed further back on the race by Diggin' for Gold, Soul Rocker. And uh, I think that was about it as they uh, reached the line, 22.41. And a very impressive win by Aston Nobility was third away, took up the running. And the further they went, the further it got in front. Five, six, should be three. Yes, it is. And fourth home, five, six, three. And the fourth is about to come up. After the running of race number six, what was there? Corborn Cross was uh, close handy, yes. So it's five, six, three, four in the frame. Four and three quarters by a half, 22.41. Quite a good gallop there. 5.09 early, 13.57. That's what the good dogs run, that uh, middle range. And 8.85 coming home. And the winner, Aston Ability, is a uh, black bitch by Raw Ability. The Adelaide Cup winner out of Aston Odious is raced by Ray Border and trained by Matthew Payne. February 19, the whelping date. So the favourite winning, and we've had, uh, we're now starting to stack them up, the favourites. Four out of six so far. Race seven is the Kurt Donsberg Photography Stake. And uh, this is uh, another challenge for punters. Going to be pretty uh, hard, 350. Stella Warning is the opening uh, favourite for race seven. We'll come back then.